This is part one of mining your darkness to connect more with what is human and to translate that into your stories. And I'll begin with be well researched, be well exposed to film, literature, art, theater uh, that explores the darkness in humanity. I am going to gear this toward film and bring you back to poof, 20 years ago or more when a friend of mine took me to an art house theater that I didn't even know existed in Louisville, Kentucky. Previous to that, I had really only seen the big budget movies, the blockbusters, the things that people would pack into the multiplex to watch. Well, I loved going to the movies. I loved movies. I'd never seen an art film. Just was never exposed to them. No one had ever shown one to me. And yet here I am going to this single screen indie theater in Louisville, Kentucky. And the film that we saw was Spanking the Monkey by David O. Russell. Same theater, same year, we saw Pie by Darren Aronofsky. And then later, same film friend, started to see some of the movies by John Waters and sort of uh, expanded from there. The first impression I got from that very first film, Walking Out of Spanking the Monkey, I felt uncomfortable, for sure. Uh, that film dealt with a very taboo theme, and incest. And it was uncomfortable to watch, and yet there was something really real and something really dark about it. There was something very resonant about it. It felt like this is someone's dark thought. We all have dark thoughts. They are part of us. They're human. They are the part of us that we tend to shelter, mask, keep hidden, um, keep secret. And yet those treasure trove thoughts, ideas, feelings that we covet so much that we refuse to share a lot of us tend to be the things that are the most human about us and the things about us that other people being scared, if they see it, it will really mean something to them. It will really resonate with them. The thing not talked about, that is the whole concept behind mining your darkness. The more comfortable you get with the darkness, the closer you will be to learning to unearth your own and channel it into your own storytelling.